वेलकम बैक टू अनदर टूटोरियल एंड टुडे आज हमने जो है जी टी एफेक्ट के ऊपर काम करना है दिस इज़ अ फोटोशॉप टूटोरियल बहुत ही बेसिक्स के साथ जो है मैं इसको स्टार्ट करूँगा लाइक यू आर एबल टू नो के वॉट आई एम ट्राइंग टू डू इन दिस और इस चीज़ के अंदर यह है कि वॉट वी आर गोइंग टू डू इज़ कि हम स्पेसिफिक फिल्टर्स फिल्टर्स के हिसाब उसके अलावा कलर ग्रेडिंग एंड उसके हिसाब से डिफरेंट टूल्स को इस्तेमाल करेंगे टू अचीव द जी टी ए लो तो सबसे पहले हम लोगों ने क्या करना है वो ये करना है कि वी आर गोइंग फॉर यू नो सबसे पहले हमने उसकी पेन uh, टूल के साथ जो है वी आर गोइंग टू डू इट और एंड वी आर मेक गोइंग टू मेक अ सेलेक्शन सेलेक्शन बनाने का जो तरीका होता है वो ये होता है कि लाइक यू हैव टू लाइक क्रिएट यूज़ अ पेन टूल यूजली ये होता है कि हेयर आपका इधर इट्स ऑन शेप सो इफ़ यू मेक द होल सेलेक्शन इट इज़ गोइंग टू टर्न इन टू शेप एंड दैट इज़ वेरी टी डी एस बिकॉज ड्यूरिंग सेलेक्शन इट इज़ गोइंग टू टेक अ लॉट ऑफ टाइम तो पहले बता दो बिफोर डूइंग एनी मिस्टेक यू गो टू दिस टैप यू ड्रॉप इट डाउन एंड यू मेक इट अ पाथ आफ्टर मेकिंग अ पाथ वॉट वी आर गोइंग टू डू इज के वी आर गोइंग टू हाई लाइट द आउटलाइन ऑफ द इमेज एंड हाउ वी आर गोइंग टू हाई लाइट द आउटलाइन ऑफ द इमेज वी आर गोइंग टू यूज द पेन टूल and you can see that i am dragging the pen accordingly i am going i am holding the uh, mouse button left mouse button and then i am trying to you know uh, make sure that i am almost close to the outline of what i am trying to make now usually it is, it depends upon the what type of apparel aapne is cheez ke andar aapki tasveer ke andar outfit kya bande ne pehni bhi hai uh, what are they wearing uske upar depend karta hai now this outfit is usually you know it's a baggy um, baggy jeans type or trouser type thing so uh, there are a lot of curves in this so we have to like accordingly make के हम इसको किस तरीके से uh, कर सकते हैं सो इट्स द यूजिंग द पेन टूल इज अ वेरी इजी प्रोसेस इट्स इट जस्ट नीड्स अ लिटिल बिट ऑफ प्रैक्टिस यू जस्ट हैव टू नो दैट व्हाट आर द बाउंड्रीज यू आर क्रिएटिंग एंड यू आर देन गुड टू गो एंड नाउ व्हाट आई एम डूइंग इज दैट आई एम जस्ट क्लिकिंग लेफ्ट क्लिक देन होल्ड द बटन टू क्रिएट दैट कर्व एंड देन वी आर गोइंग टू मूव इट अपवर्ड्स really slowly according to the outline of the uh, subject um you can like uh, change it into rename it into subject and after renaming it to subject so it gets saved now what you are going to do is that you are going to come back to the layers and after coming to the layers aapne kya karna hai ki is path ko pehle select kiya make selection ki and you are going to press okay jab bhai aapka okay ho jayega now you have created that path and now it is saved now you are going to move back into the layers aur layers mein wapas ja ke aapne kya karna hai ki you are going to use this so the whole path has cut the background and now you have got this uh, layer so now what we are going to do is that we have already done with the cutting and now we are going to move forward towards uh, you know uh, applying the effects so what we are going to do the first is ki humne kya karna hai ki we are going to uh, control press control j to create a copy and uh, this would be called subject filter सब्जेक्ट फिल्टर आने के बाद आपने इसके अंदर क्या करना है कि आपने सबसे पहले सब्जेक्ट फिल्टर पे जाके इसको अनहाइट करना है यू आर गोइंग टू गो टू फिल्टर ब्लर गैलरी ब्लर एंड यू आर गोइंग टू अप्लाई सरफेस ब्लर ओके अब जो है आप इसको देख रहे हैं कि इट इज वे मोर देन व्हाट वी नीड सो वॉट वी आर गोइंग टू डू इज वी आर गोइंग टू मूव बैक इट टू टू हम फुल आगे तक ले जाएंगे एंड देन वी आर गोइंग टू सेलेक्ट दैट वॉट इज द मोस्ट अप्रोप्रिएट वैल्यू फॉर और Uh, you know radius so maybe a little bit of 2 and after 2 we are going to increase the threshold like here uh, around here okay aur uske baad jo hai hum isko preview mein dekhte rahenge ke how it's looking you can go a, a little bit down we don't want to like obliterate the whole of the details we just want ke iske andar we see some of it so abhi I'm just you know experimenting with the values that what will look good. So you see that 
when you move it around you see a lot of detail around it but when you move, remove it you see all all of it layer so ye sara saaf ho jata hai aapne basic jo hai main jo bahut zyada detail hai jo real detail hai usko khatam karna hai isko aapne okay karna hai jab aapka ye wala filter lag jayega uske baad aapne sabse pehle kya karna hai ke we are going for maybe at the highlights and shadows to aapne kya karna hai image adjustments and isko humne kabhi bhi istemal nahi karte but it is very effective so here we can increase the highlights you see we are increasing the highlights that automatically jo hai wo detail ko lights ko jo hai kam kiya ja raha hai okay maybe you can like increase the shadows uh here something like this okay 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 and now i think that is good and uske baad then you are going to increase you know the color adjustment color ko aap apni taraf se kitna bhi karna hai wo kiya ja sakta hai it is automatically going to affect ke yahan pe kitna color receive ho raha hai so for me i guess 69 would be great and then we are going for okay now we have put the shadows and highlights aur uske baad humne kya karna hai ki humne jana hai masks mein sharpen mein unsharp mask and then what we are going to do is ki hum isko value ko full increase kar denge and then we are going to play with the you know uh something like this uh here itni detail hame chahiye so we are what we are going to do is we are going to make it something like this and then we are going to hit okay isko kabhi bhi hum change kar sakte hain filters ko kabhi bhi change kiya ja sakta hai i think ke unsharp mask is a little bit more so what i am going to do is ke hum isko kam kar denge value ko just a little bit of you know let me go and uske baad humne kya karna hai ki uske baad filter mein jana hai aapne stylize mein jana hai and then we are going to put on diffuse or diffuse ke andar aapne kya karna hai ki you are going to use an is an isotropic and then humne kya karna hai isko hit okay it is going to have a very little bit of effect on it but it is very much effective if you put on it and then we are going to put the diffuse again and then we are going to turn it uh maybe one time is that is fine and then what we are going to do is that okay wait and uske baad jo hai we are going for the most important and most used filter and that would be stylize uh wait a minute let me go to let's stylize and oil paint when we give the the final effect of oil paint i don't want that these details should be this much blurry and because it would be looking really bad so what we are going to do is i am going to maybe turn it down turn it down a little, little bit and 0.1 0.2 would be fine for me and that's it so we want some sort of a shine in the details so hum kya karenge hum jayenge sharpen and sharp mask now i don't want that this should sharpen a lot but i am so you see ke iske andar kisne fit tarike se shine automatically is cheez ke andar aa rahi hai and now what we are going to go for is we are going to go to filter we are going to sharpen and sharp mask again and maybe move it a little bit down something like just play with the amount and see ke what are the effects i am just going for the basic process that what you should do is that it should not look like a typical oil paint photo it should look like a real gta type image so we are getting there a little slowly and gradually and now what we are going to do is we are going to filter we are going to go to stylize and we are going to defy diffuse it again okay and then we are going to hit okay uh I think I don't want the diffuse this time so you can include it uh just to give you a first uh, heads up that iske andar jo hai aapne jitna bhi quality hogi na tasveer ki jitni quality aap zyada kar sakte hain you can 
इंक्रीज दैट बिकॉज जितनी क्वालिटी बेहतर होगी उतनी ज़्यादा जो आपकी पेन टूल के साथ कटिंग हुई है वो अफेक्ट लेके आएगी आपके इमेज के ऊपर सो बी श्योर ऑफ दैट आई एम जस्ट गिविंग यूर सैम्पल सो इट्स नॉट दैट मच ऑफ एन एच डी फोटो बट इट गिवस दैट टाइप ऑफ लुक सो नाउ वट वी आर गोइंग टू डू इज दैट वी आर गोइंग टू फिल्टर नॉइज रिड्यूस नॉइज ओके वी आर गोइंग टू इंक्रीज दिस सेटिंग्स एंड देन वी आर गोइंग टू प्रेस ओके ओके नाउ वी आर गोइंग फॉर शार्प एन एंड शार्प मैस्क एंड देन अगेन a little bit of sharpening and then we are going to press okay so now we want to obliterate it uh wait a minute just give me and then we are going to press on blur surface blur and i guess that's fine wait a minute okay so i guess that would is looking perfectly well now zoom out and uh, let's see what we have to do next uh i don't want to add unsharp mask again i think it is totally giving the best options right now and then what we are going to do is we are going for another filter and that would be another layer i press control j to duplicate this we are going to filter and cut out now you are going to go to filter filter gallery and then you are going for cut out okay i don't want these type these much a lot of levels in this but what we are going to see is wait let me salmon would be nice i think and then we are going to press okay I don't want the opacity to really ruin the uh, my object and uske andar hum log kya karenge ke hum iske andar we are going to put in wait a minute uh I think that's fine this this is looking totally okay now we are what we are going to do is we are going to image we are going for adjustments and then we are going for the curves and then for the curves aapne iske andar kya karna hai ki you are going to increase the highlights to make it brighter and a little bit you know just play with it see how you are going to i don't want it a lot, a lot of red maybe a little bit of shine and here we go okay and then we are going to okay you can use uh, brightness and contrast also but i prefer the curves and uske baad jo hai hum logo ne kya karna hai ki humne इसको कट आउट के अंदर जाके वी आर गोइंग टू पुट इन मे बी वेट अ मिनट ओके फिफ्टी परसेंट ओपैसिटी इज टोटली फाइन फॉर मी अराउंड हेयर एंड फिल्टर शार्प रन एंड अनशार्प मैस्क एंड नाउ ऑल द वे आप गो take the amount all the way up and then just play with the radius you see and i guess the threshold should be zero and then, yeah this looks totally fine and now zoom out and it looks slowly is going to that y box gta aur ab humne kya karna hai ki hamare paas ek spare copy thi uh, the same one wait uh control j background background filter filter cut out cut out copy now okay so wait a minute so we kept a layer back here jisko humne istemal nahi kiya tha uske liye hum log kya karenge ki hum sabse pehle isko to clean out karenge and now what we are going to do is ki hum iske andar सब्जेक्ट की कॉपी बनाए आप बैकग्राउंड की कॉपी एंड इसको फुल ऊपर ले जाएं एंड देन उसके बाद इसको सब्जेक्ट शेडो पुट इट डाउन ऑन सब्जेक्ट शेडो टर्न ऑन लाइट्स 
एंड देन वॉट वी आर गोइंग टू डू इसके हमें डिटेल्स की बिल्कुल भी ज़रूरत नहीं है और हमें क्या करना है कि फिल्टर ब्लर सरफेस ब्लर एंड देन वी आर लाइक गोइंग टू इंक्रीज दिस सो मच दैट वी डोंट वॉन्ट एनी टाइप ऑफ डिटेल राइट नाउ थर्टी सिक्स वुड बी फाइन जस्ट अ लिटल बिट ओके दिस वर्कस अराउंड फाइन ओके एंड देन वी आर गोइंग टू गो टू फिल्टर गैलरी एंड वी आर गोइंग फॉर स्केच एंड देन वी आर गोइंग टू पुट इन दिस स्टैम्प एंड देन वी आर गोइंग टू प्रेस ओके नॉट ओके वी हैव टू लाइक सी दैट हाउ वी आर गोइंग टू यूज दिस स्टैम्प एंड हेयर हमने क्या करना है कि हमने लाइट एंड डार्कनेस को चेक करना है लाइट डार्क बैलेंस समथिंग लाइक दिस मे बी लिटिल बेट ऑफ यू नो दिस ओके एंड नाउ वॉट वी आर गोइंग टू डू इज दैट वी आर गोइंग टू पुट इट ऑन स्क्रीन एंड वेट अ मिनट लेट मी सी blend mode you have to change the blend mode to normal to multiply and then we are going to decrease the opacity just to bring in the shadows more okay and then we are going to go for maybe okay now aapne kya karna hai ki aapne iske andar layer ko create karna hai ek aur aapne ek path banaya hua tha isko make selection karni hai एंड इसको ओके करना है एंड देन आपने अपनी लेयर्स में जाना है एंड एडिट एंड यू आर गोइंग टू पुट इन दिस स्ट्रोक यू कैन डाइट टर्न द कलर ऑफ द स्ट्रोक बाय ब्लैक एंड आई थिंक ब्लैक इज फाइन या ओके एंड देन आपने क्या करना है वेट एडिट स्ट्रोक आपने इसको हमेशा लोकेशन को सेंटर रखना है एंड इसकी जो स्ट्रोक है उसको आई गेस नाइन वुड बी फाइन एंड देन प्रेस ओके नाइन इज़ अ लिटल बिट मोर मैं इसको और कम करना चाहता हूँ तो हम इसके अंदर क्या करेंगे स्ट्रोक को फाइव पे कर देते हैं एंड नाउ देन नाउ दिस लुक्स ओके एंड नाउ आपने सिलेक्शन डी सेलेक्ट एंड नाउ यू कैन सी के यू हैव गॉट दिस होल आउटलाइन हेयर ठीक है अब आपने क्या करना है कि अब मेरे लिहाज से इट इज़ ऑलमोस्ट डन बट वी हैव टू रियली इन पोट इन दी कलर ग्रेडियंट्स इन इट और कलर ग्रेडियंट्स कहाँ से आते हैं कि आपने अपनी लेयर को सेलेक्ट किया एंड देन आपने इसके अंदर कलर लुकअप में गए कलर लुकअप में जाने के बाद यू आर गोइंग टू लाइक सेलेक्ट एंड सी वट वुड लुक रियली गुड एज ए जी डी ए बट इट ऑल डिपेंड्स अपॉन दैट वॉट टाइप ऑफ यू नो यू आर यूजिंग मे बी बैकग्राउंड यू आर यूजिंग so what i'm going to do is that i'm going to go and like see that what type of background we can look into i'm just going to give you a sample background sample gta background and like you can uh, use any type of background you need so we need a road uh, because we have to put our subject where it's standing right now and for that what we are going to do is that main yahan se mere paas ek already image pada hua hai i'm going to move it here and uh, then let me like drag it to the location i'm going to do here uh, back up and uh, yeah i got it aur isko jo hai aapne exact bottom mein le jana hai and uh, i don't want this color look up right now so i'm going to delete this aur uske baad jo hai aapne background ko is tarike se select karna hai ke aapka jo subject hai it doesn't look like odd that standing somewhere you know not the right place or something like that so for that what i am going to do is that i am going to try to settle it down a little bit maybe you know let me move it back so here and then uh, i think this is not looking that much great maybe uh let us like try and find something else maybe a little bit better uh maybe this background would look nice 
uh, it all depends upon the fact that what type of you are using background you're using let me like just go into it and see dot what we can do uh, so maybe we are going for this looks fine save image and we are going to go to backup and let me see here we go so you can see that all automatically our background is like settling with our figure subject main first subject and uh, we can like move it something like here and see what we can do with it then i'm going to make this a group control g and then i'm going to use this group to move it down maybe okay so something like that now you can see that maybe we have got our figure to be standing but i want it to be a little bit you know uh, have shadows also so for that what i'm going to do is i'm going to use brush tool not this man control j and here i'm going to try to make that shadow so it looks a little bit you know easier to see uh, i'm just trying to maybe increase to the point where we can like see or uske baad jo hai now it looks a little bit fine with the shadow we don't want that the shadow should be black this much so we are going to turn off the opacity a little bit something like this and then uh, wait let me just go okay something like this and now we are going to move it something edit transform scale uh, i know this is a little bit frustrating but you know we have to like see how things can be possible uh right now the problem is that the subject is looking way bigger than our background but if i put it like this maybe control j control j and uh, maybe use this burn tool yeah Uh, or maybe we can use you know eraser tools yeah something like this we're going like to decrease the hardness maybe upwards and i think that looks totally fine and after that we are going to now use that layer which we made and that is color look up and now let's see what looks really good uh something like this looks okay and now what we are going to do is that now we, our whole subject is finally done and now we are going to make it maybe edit transform scale and maybe turn it up and uh, for this one we are going to use the eraser tool again uh, maybe not razor we can use a clamp tool also let me okay i think the razor tool will be fine maybe here yeah something like this here 
maybe something like this would be fine. And I won't want this to be you know. Yeah, that would be perfect. And now we are done. You just have to save the file, control, save as, and then hum isko jo hai, uh, you can save it anywhere. Uh, anywhere. And yahan pe isko PNG karunga. We will put it as Jesse. And then we are going to control as save. And now it's done. Thank you for watching this tutorial. And hope to see you guys very soon. Uh, I know that I wasn't able to like uh, fully explain the process like uh, with audio and something like that but I tried my best uh, a little bit you know tired up and uh, sort of the covered and eat and stuff like that so I hope you guys really like this tutorial for any type of queries just drop your comment in the uh, comment section and do subscribe to my channel and see you guys very soon Allah Hafiz take care